already? Whoa! It's still night. So what are all those lights? <gasps> it can't be. Or can it? A spaceship. I have just seen a spaceship. <gasps> Rosie! Rosie, come and see, quick! What is it, Raggles? I was sleeping. There's a spaceship in the sky. Look! Look up there! Raggles, what are you talking about? <sighs> you must have been dreaming. <sighs> Go back to sleep. I did see one. I did. I've had breakfast. Now I'm going to look for clues. What clues? Spaceship clues. I did see a spaceship last night, you know. Oh, Raggles, I'm sure you saw something. But a spaceship? Rosie, I'm going to prove it. Morning, Big Bird! <laughs> Morning, Raggles! So, what happened here then? A big wind must have blown these branches down last night. Well, I didn't hear a big wind, but I did hear a spaceship. <gasps> and it looks like it knocked the branches off this tree. Oh! A spaceship? <gasps> Hello! Morning, Will. Would you like one of my cakes? Oh. Oh. Thanks, Holly. You look so tired, Will. What have you been doing? Oh, I've been making some changes to my ghost beater. Right. Oh, let's see. Sorry, Holly. You'll have to wait until tonight. It's a very important top secret mission. Now I'm off for a nap. Oh, thanks for the cake. So, Oakley, you saw a strange light too. Was it bright? Um, yes, quite bright. Bright enough to be from a spaceship. <gasps> You don't mean... Yes! I think we have both seen a spaceship. <gasps> a spaceship? Can you two keep the noise down? I had a late night last night. I'm trying to get my beauty sleep. <sighs> Sorry, Bluebird. It came from up there. Look! Look at the cross. It's all short. Another clue. Ah, quiet! Morning, Big Bear. You look busy. Morning, Rosie. Oh, these spaceships certainly make a mess when they bump into trees. What spaceships? Oh, Raggle said a spaceship knocked the branches off this tree last night. <laughs> it may not have been a spaceship, you know. Hmm, a feather. Maybe this has something to do with it. Rosie! Take me to the fields near Big Bear's den. Ahem. Oh, uh, please. <laughs> Hang on, Raggles. Well, something has cut the grass short. It's very strange, Raggles. Only one thing could have done this. A landing spaceship! Are you really sure? Yes. In fact, I'm so sure that tonight I am going to sit up on Oakley's Hill and wait for it to come back. Oh, this is so exciting! 
morning, Rosie. Good morning, Mr. Mordy. Mrs. Mordy. What are you doing? Oh, well, we couldn't sleep a wink last night. Some naughty birds were making so much noise flapping here and whooshing there. So tonight we'll sleep in this log. And we're blocking out all the noise with this grass. Noisy, Noisy birds! birds. <laughs> That's <laughs> right, kids. So you cut the grass. And noisy birds in the night. Hmm. I know it's going to come back. I just know it. Raggles, sometimes there's more than one reason why something happens. What do you mean, Rosie? Well, you said a spaceship made that short patch in the long grass, but it was really Mr. Mordy and his family. Oh, well, how can you explain the broken branches at the showground, hey? Hey? Oh, Raggles, I found this stuck to a broken branch. A big, heavy bird could have crashed into the tree and broken the branches. <laughs> OK. How do you explain the lights, then? The ones I saw last night. The ones Oakley saw. Didn't you, Oakley? Oh, yes. Like those over there. <gasps> The same lights I saw last night. Oh, spaceships! They were fluffy bugs, Raggles. Oh, I know what a fluffy bug looks like. What I saw was bigger and it made a big whooshing noise. Maybe it's our bedtime too, Raggles. <sighs> OK, Rosie. Do you know, I haven't seen Will today. Or Holly. Or Bluebird. I saw Bluebird. <laughs> she was really sleepy and very grumpy. <gasps> Rosie, look! Raggles, I don't believe it. It's... it's... <laughs> what do you think of my glow speeder? He worked on it all last night. Great, isn't it? It's amazing. But why the lights? Mm. Thanks, Holly. They're landing lights. Looper, Teal and Manny have been practicing night flight. Oh, Nick, here they come now. <laughs> to fly at night? Why not? Owls fly at night. And if owls can do it, so can we! <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Holly. Ooh, cakes. <laughs> the trouble is, they're not very good at landing in the dark, so I made landing lights so they can all land safely. Well, nearly all of them. <laughs> <laughs> so it wasn't a spaceship, Raggles. It was Will's glow speeder all along. OK, who wants a ride? Oh, me! Me! <laughs> Look, Rosie, I'm in a spaceship. Woo! Woo! <laughs> Yes, Raggles. Can you see the shapes the stars make? <gasps> Look, a car. See, and there's a little girl over there. She's got funny ribbons. <laughs> hey, it's you, Rosie. Where? Show me. Raggles, I do not have funny ribbons. <laughs> <laughs> well, I think it's time for bed. Oh, me too. <gasps> Rosie! Come and see! Oh, it's such 
a windy day, Rosie. You can say that again. Whoa! 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 <laughs> Here, let me help. Whoa! Whoa! Say it again. It's such a windy day, Rosie. I know. I wonder how everyone else is getting on. Strong, my kite just blew away. I got soaked by the fountain. Oh, my leaves, my lovely soft leaves, all gone. So is my washing. And my cake. Oh, I'm still dizzy. Are you all right, Oakley? I'm fine, but look, part of the fence is broken. We can fix that, can't we, Raggles? We can? Yes. Come on, we've got work to do. Oh, Nat, look at our dam. It's full of holes, Matt. I know. Must have been the wind. Let's get, get to work. work. Smear. Pebble, another leak on your left. Oh, mind it. <laughs> okay, Mega Mender Raggles, here goes. What you are, Mega Mender Will. Sorry, Bluebird. They're the softest I have. Oh, hello, Rosie. Have found any more washing yet? Yes. Oh, I wondered what had been tickling me. Help, please. Our dam is full of... Holes. Pebbles and bark are no good. Has anyone got anything else we can plug them with? You can try this. And my favourite pine cone. Here. You can try my spare yo-yo. Thank you. Anyway, take a look at how the Mega Menders have mended the fence. Oh. Hmm. Oh. I don't think this is going to work. No, me neither. Would you like to try this? Oh, no thanks, Rosie. What we need is twigs.
Right. <laughs> no, too lumpy. Ooh. The Mega Menders have now fixed the fence. We glued it in this time. <laughs> <laughs> Now to pick some lovely plums from my favorite tree to make another cake. <gasps> oh no! It's blown down. No! Too hard! Too... Oh, just not right! <laughs> oh dear. I don't think any of these leaves will do. And I still can't find the sock that goes with this one. And we can't fix these broken bits of fence back together. Whatever we do, it isn't strong enough. What is it, Big Bear? Oh, I'm afraid I've got some sad news, everyone. <sighs> oh no, the plum tree. Don't be too sad, Rosie. For every end is a new beginning. Hmm, I think I understand. And it's given me an idea. So you see, although it's sad that the plum tree has been blown over, perhaps there's a way that we can each take something from it and use it for something good. What do you mean? I just don't see how that's going to work. <gasps> oh, these leaves. They're so soft. Oh, <gasps> Holly, quick, help me. Oh. <laughs> well, I could still use this last crop of plums to make another cake. And these twigs? Are you thinking what I'm thinking? That they're exactly what we need. To mend the dam. I was thinking what you were thinking. Hmm. And maybe... Can you hold this, please, Raggles? Yes! The trunk is just the right length to mend the fence with. The Mega Menders are <laughs> back in business. <laughs> have come from something that seemed so sad at first. Especially this cake. Oh, it's yummy. <laughs> I'm glad Big Bear had a few plums left over when he made his cake. Mmm, me too. I know. Let's plant the plum stones. Now two trees will grow where the old one fell. Which means twice as many plums next time. <laughs> Yay! 